と冗談は置いておいて話は分かってくれた No. Hi, welcome back to Fate Night Heavens Field. Last time, we were going to essentially try to figure out how to use Mega Ultimate Weapon that they're thinking of via projection and some materials. And, you know, all that sort of fun stuff. Still recording a bit ahead, uh, more than, much more than usual, because uh, I have the chance to. So, let us continue. So, let us continue. I would say I have no choice in my current state of mind. It's the only option. Yeah. したがうも何も造形が倒せるなら文句はないぞ。はっきり言うわ。アーチャーの魔術を習うってことは、アーチャーの腕の束縛を解くってことよ。つまりね、ここで東映の鍛錬をする間は、その生涯符を外せって言
It sounds more like a plea than a warning. I grasp my left arm. That's covered by the red cloth. I don't want to take this off either. What? ってのはどうするんだ。布を溶かないとあいつの魔術構成は引き出せないんじゃないのか。もちろん。だからここは無理を承知で少しだけ生涯符の工作を緩めてもらうわ。そうだな。じゃあさっき盗作が言った布を外
Okay. Answer alert. Oh, did we have one last time? I forget. Sate. She leaves the two of them and comes out into the yard. Ah, uh, yes, that, that would explain why she went away. The Sakura coldly regards the girl before her. Mato Sakura looks down uneasily. There are no words between them. Rin mercilessly condemns the outsider, Sakura, who is at a loss for words, feeling beholden and inferior. Sakura? Sakura trembles a bit. Her older sister is bitter. She corners Sakura, even when she knows of her uneasiness. Pushing herself, Sakura looks at her ideal, her older sister. Rin cuts off the girl. Sakura's purposely leaving her out of like what's happening specifically, so that if she does turn, she doesn't know exactly what's planned. Yeah, they have been pretty secretive about the specifics of the plan up until just recently without her around. いい、サクラ。戦闘に参加せず、ライダーでこの家を守ろうが、あなたが造形の手ごまであることに変わりはないの。そんな相手の前で鍛錬なんてできるわけないでしょう。Face with the cold words, Sakura can only stand there. Sakurin is serious. Unlike Shiro, her sister was worrying about when she might fall under Zoken's sway and become their enemy. No. Rin probably assumes that they will end up as enemies. She bites her lip. As Rin says, Sakura can fall into Zoken's hands at any time. Her body's getting worse every day and her memory's becoming more vague. Her only respite came when she slept, but now she's begun having those nightmares. It'll be no surprise if she goes crazy at any time. そういうこと。何よりそんな魔力不足の体でうろつかれちゃ迷惑よ。今のあなたはいつ倒れるかわからない。まあ、今は落ち着いているようだから倒れたりしないだろうけど、無理をすればするほど、エミヤ君が心配
Even if 10,000 units are poured, the excess will overflow and the container will only hold 10. That will only be painful. I made sure Roe will gain less than a tenth of the agony he goes through. And most of all, a person with a normal mind would never be able to endure it. And if you set a mud puppet against a tidal wave, the puppet will always be washed away. That's what loosening the shroud means. それだけじゃない。先輩は姉さんを信じています。信じてるからそんな無邪なことだって受け入れる。けど、そんなことをしていたら結局最後には姉さんの一言で花布だって外してしまうに決まってます。さくら。Sakura does not look down. She stares straight at her sister. So, ne. Kedo Sakura, but as she got you an act demo, I to a jibun para segai who has a stetawa. Saki Hanastete, Sorega Wakachata. What if I. Okay, what if, what if I said no? Oh my. Honto do Castelua. But as she got on the whom you took up stemone. きっと最後には何でもないことみたいに外しちゃうのよ。はい。そう。それがわかるから、そんなことをしなくてもいい方法を提示するしかなかった。外さなくてもなんとかなるって知っていれば、あいつだってギリギリまで我慢するでしょ
私はあいつが戦いを望む以上全力で力を貸すし<笑> She cannot say anything The girl cannot say anything back to her sister Who is full of intimidating confidence 話はそれだけじゃあ部屋に戻りなさいここにいられたら迷惑だって言ったでしょ Saka Rin turns around and heads to the dojo. The girl watches as if it's a distant scene. The familiar yard is vast. There's nothing around, and it feels like nothing is within reach. In that artificial solitude. So, Senpai Made Totte Tishimano. Nessa. The girl murmurs something without emotion. Yes, maybe it wasn't a great idea to push the person who is on the edge of going crazy. Well, I don't know when Saka got back, but she's in front of me, apparently. What? <laughs> Is it actually? I don't think it's actually. I mean, if you could understand Japanese, you might be understand what they're saying, right? No idea, though. I, I think this is clearly like. Uh, I mean, he's out of it, so he has no idea. Hmm. That's strange. Why are they talking secretly in front of me? Maybe my throat is bad as I can't talk in a big voice. Uh, their conference abruptly ends. My bad. Oh, it's back now. It seems a loud voice did the trick. What? Wait, what? Oh, is that all you guys were talking about, or are you faking it? Hmm, I did hear a lunch in there though, right? It seems they're talking about lunch. It actually might literally be the time. I stop, uh, stop halfway into my sentence. I see the clock and find out it's almost noon. Something's snagging at the back of my mind. Nothing strange, the dojo is the same as always, but I'm getting chills. It. Saka left at 9 o'clock. Information I don't know in my head. Groceries. I responded to the conversation. Something in my head. Details of every weapon. At least that's something concerning. The pain of the white arm skipping 40 is 26 times. The memory disappeared and returned. <sighs> okay. So he's getting some of those memories back? I hit my forehead with my fingers. It's fine. The dizziness is gone now. Shiro? What are you uh, okay, so we tied in the shroud up again. I look through my memory. I did indeed say we'll go shopping together. Hmm. I shake my head and start walking. Just this is nothing compared to the pain from yesterday, and my body feels fine. I was just a bit dizzy, so there's no problem at all. Hmm. Status and. What would update in that? Uh, I don't know. I'm not really sure. What would upgrade? Huh. Okay, well, um, confused, but I suppose not that confused. 
I go outside with Elia. We can't spare the time to go shopping often, so we'll just have to push ourselves and buy about three days' worth of groceries. Okay. それじゃ、派手に買い込むか。イリアは何がいい差し当たっては昼飯のメニューだけど。あれお昼はシチューじゃないのシロ、さっきそう言ってたけど。Did I? Okay, so this is just another example of something going on, and I guess Emmy doesn't totally realize it, but I feel like he should realize that he's not remembering things. And to just mention, yeah, that sounds right, but I don't know, something's off. He could just, you know, I can say it. This is 100% the route of people not speaking up when they fucking should. We head to the familiar butcher. We're buying three days worth of groceries after all. We can't waste money, so we have to walk around to find cheap, high quality goods. And after 30 minutes of fast paced store hopping. <laughs> Ilya looks bored while we were shopping, but she's laughing now with groceries in hand. <laughs> I hold out the lightest of the seven bags I'm holding. うん、重くないから大丈夫。それよりもう一個も取っか。白、いっぱい袋下げてて、ぶどうみたいだよ。いや、俺も平気なんだけど、ぶどうってのはまたすごい例えだな。it's okay. Ilya chatters happily, then starts running. It's not heavy, but I'm scared of the tofus and the eggs breaking. Can tofu break? I, I don't think I've ever had tofu before. I I've never really saw it as something that could, you know, quote, break. And well, I'm scared, so I sign follow him after Ilya with quick steps. That's the biggest compromise I can make, so I was put in charge of buying groceries. So if I follow after Ilya while being careful of with uh, with what I'm carrying, Ilya must like it because she looks really happy. Yeah, she definitely doesn't get to do this very often. Ilya stops running and starts to walk beside me once we get to the intersection. singing. It unfortunately did not actually go to the melody, but close-ish. It's a familiar melody. I think I heard the song in school when I was a kid. Really, you heard what is probably a German melody? I don't recognize it. I'm not sure if I'm remembering it from this or if it actually is familiar from something else. Because I assume it's from this that I recognize it from. Like this song specifically going on in the background. Wonderbar. I can't see her expression since we're walking side by side. There's no way for me to check. And... Huh. What kind of face she's making. As that... 
He's, he doesn't have the shroud on in that, does he? Huh. What kind of face she's making as she sings? That went all the way to the hand, right? Or how she's feeling as she walks back home. familiar melody. Uh, the simple song is easy and high, but because of that, it sounds lonely. Ely's probably happy. That's why she's singing as we walk home. I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if it translates as, like, something really grim. <laughs> but I think of another reason at the same time. It's natural for Ilya to sing. She could only sing by herself on her way home, and she had neither friends to talk to nor a father to wait for her. If globally burned the street, can I'm held the ship of God? And as a melody, I can tell the lie I get. Okay, there's the shroud. I thought I covered the fingers. Hmm. On the side of the road, I look at the tall concave mirror. And the mirror is me holding many groceries, and a girl singing with her eyes closed. It's nothing. It looks like normal siblings going home after shopping. It looks so natural that it makes me imagine. What if Kritsuki were between the boy, holding the bags, and the singing girl? How happy that would be. Uh... Idia! If... And if that is years out of possibility. I call out to her. Oh, she turns back innocently. That's because she's suppressing her true feelings. Ely is killing her own emotions. Ely's kept something bottled up within her ever since Archer disappeared. That's why we can hang out like this. Because Ely can't smile like this unless she keeps her true self hidden. I'm the same way. I'm postponing something I already know. I'm running away from what I have to say. I just went along with Ely's lie. Shiro? Ely probably gave up. She stopped pressing the problem on us and, uh, going along with our N. That's fine. If Elia likes this relationship and wants to keep ignoring that, I won't lose anyone. But, still. Elia, there's something wrong with me. I'm not gonna live through this. I'm about to say something I don't have to. But I have to say it while I can. I'm going to go crazy. I'm going to go crazy, so... Ilya, I have to ask her before I go crazy. She stops. Ilya answers in an emotionless voice. How about I mean it as Ilya's brother? Looking quietly at my face. Kuritsuku's son. What Kuritsuku couldn't do and what Kuritsuku abandoned. I am Kuritsuku's son. Even if I'm not... Even if I'm not blood related. So, I must assume his duties. I have to face this girl not as Emi Shiro, but as Emi Kuritsuku's son. That... That is what Ely is asking me. And of course. Ah. 
いや俺じゃ切り継ぐにはなれないし切り継ぐの代わりもできない俺と切り継ぐは別の人間だ切り継ぐとしてイリアに返せることなんて俺にはないけど俺は親父が好きだ親父にできなかったことを果たしてやりたいだからイリアが切り継ぐを憎む心の中に少しでも許してやってもいいって気持ちがあるんなら俺はイリアと一緒に暮らしたい今までできなかった分これから取り返していくのはダメか今のままでいいからイリアと一緒に暮らしちゃいけないのか<笑> You know the more happy after the war promises we make the less likely The less likely there's a chance for Emiya to actually live, there is. There's no reply. Emily looks down. And after shaking her head. Sorry, I'm not sure. 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 もう分かってるでしょええどっちかがどっちかを犠牲にすれば少しは生きられるかもしれないけど2人一緒は無理だと思うこの戦いが終わった時私が生きてるってことはシロンはもういないってことだもの You mean in the nature of the Holy Grail stuff not necessarily your short lifespan? ほらだからできないのシロがいないエミアの家には私の居場所はないんだからエミアの声に対する気持ちがあるからエミアの声に対する気持ちがあるでもちょっと残念かな今の言葉もうちょっと早く言ってくれたらよかったのにそうしたらうんそうしたらほんの少しだけ運命は変わっていたかもしれないから。The motherfucking route of motherfucking never saying things when you should! Like the game even tells you at this point. Oh my goodness. I don't get what Eli is saying. I don't get why one of us has to die. Or why she has given up and can say such things with a smile. Baka, you know. So, I'm not going to be able to do it. ゾウケンがイリアを狙っていようとその前に俺たちでゾウケンを倒すイリアだってそのために遠坂に協力してくれてるんだろそうねけどそれが問題なのこれはリンには黙っていてね宝石剣の投影遠坂の遺産を複製することはリンの方法じゃできないのあ、oh, あ、okay. だってシロウの投影は投影魔術じゃないんだもの。What does that mean? Wait, wait. 普通の投影魔術ならある程度オリジナルに似せたものに投影を重ねて補強することはできる。けどシロウの投影は違うわ。シロウは1から10まで全部を自分のイメージで作らないと形にできない。Wouldn't normal projection magic also allow you to do that? Date, Anata no Majitsua toe janakte, Jibun no Kokoro, Gugenka Sirmonanakara. Idia, Toste. How does she know the nature of Archer's magic? Dakara Murina no Binga Hitsio to stay the mono of Tsukurunia. Chiro Archer no Udeo Tsukashkanai. さっきみたいな一時的な記憶の欠損なんかじゃ済まされない一度でも使えばシロウはもうシロウでいられなくなる OK she knows fucking everything I bet Tosaka knows all this too at the very least I think e l i a probably brought it up before and I think they're just sort of betting on it maybe working at this point because it's the only thing they can think of シロウは自分のことサクラのこと私のことでいっぱいいっぱいでちょっと混乱してるんだよだから今の誘いは忘れてあげるシローだってわかってるでしょ
Ely turns her back and goes up the hill. I, I can't hear the familiar song anymore. And her words linger in my ears. You can only choose one. A crashing sound comes from the kitchen. It's very yellow in here. This is the fourth time this afternoon. Saka's voice comes from the kitchen. Saka must be tired of scolding here because she just sits there quietly. It's before six. Saka's making dinner as she requested. Saka and I were kicked out of the kitchen, so we're waiting for dinner without doing anything. <gasps> sound of another dropped plane. In just half a day, I've grown used to hearing the sound of Saka's mistakes. It all started out earlier today. Saka couldn't make her stew after we returned from shopping. When we came home, she was clearly not feeling well. You know, should you really be making food? Like, I understand if you have a fever, if we're gonna call you sick, we know what it is, but... I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna say, would you normally let someone who has, like, the symptoms of being sick make, you know, food? <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm sure Sakura could have made lunch, and I bet we let her make food back when, uh, back when we legitimately thought the uh, thought that she was sick, right? Uh, but I can't push her when she has a fever. At around two o'clock, Sakura and I managed to persuade her to take a nap, and at that time, we promised her. Ah, uh, that. And later in that afternoon. Sakura was starting to cook uh, in the kitchen after more training that ended before I knew it. You know, the memory loss might not, uh, might not be so bad when I can't remember all the pain. Sakura goes back to work full of spirit, but I can instantly tell she's just bluffing. You must be tired to go ahead and rest. Sakura doesn't back down even when I tell her to Sakura and I will do the cooking instead. <sighs> Okay, have you ever fought? I don't think you have. Maybe she's just being obstinate and Sakura does not back down. On top of that, she wouldn't even accept any help from Sasaka or me. Tazaka's surprise is so unexpected that I'm stunned. I feel like she probably wants some control over something, probably, right? だって、姉さんは先輩を鍛えてくれているでしょ。なら、私だって役立つじゃいられません。私も姉さんみたいに何かの役に立ちたい。それに、これは私が今まで受け持ってきた役割だから、これだけはずっと。This must be the one thing one thing Sakura can't give up. It only make you uneasy if you can't do something that's been part of your routine for a long time. Alright, I'll leave you in charge of dinner. Sakura started to criticize me. But... It was nothing compared to Sakura's joy. I'm just waiting for the and nobody ate dinner that night moment. A cheerful voice echoes through the room. Sakura starts putting the dishes on the uh, onto the table. Oh, takikomi-gohan. She's filled with confidence. Everything looks delicious, like she put all her heart into it. Uh, okay. I'm pretty sure the secret ingredient is her high spirits. Oh, not love? Wow. Woo! Woo! The three of us at the table clap. 
一時はどうなるものかと思ったけど我慢した分の見返りはありそうねじゃあありがたくいただきます私も遠慮なくいただくわシロそっちのフォークちょうだいはいよじゃあそれじゃ俺も失礼してはいおかわりありますからいっぱい食べてくださいね I bow and reach out for the steam shrimp wrap. It's bite sized, looking more like a steamed dumpling. It looks pretty. The topping of green onion, ginger, and radish sprout. I was worried about liking sakura cook for all four of us, but this is more than. I freeze. All three of us make a sour face in an instant. So, if she can't really taste stuff, then that probably means that she won't be able to properly prepare food since you probably need to taste test things as you make them, right? We continue eating as if nothing happened. No, we can only continue eating. None of the food on the table is good. It's not that they're terrible. But everything seems to lack something. Or, but I guess the taste is out of balance? In an awkward silence. I don't make eye contact, but wordlessly continue eating. But it should be impossible to keep deceiving Sakura. She's the one who made it. She knows right away if she starts eating. Our silence is only delaying the problem. Okay, well this will reveal her taste problems good and like really quickly, right? I look at Sakura. She must have realized it by now. Sakura should be shocked, but she hasn't even taken a bite yet. I keep looking at her. What's going on? Sakura's looking down at her bowl and her chopstick with a troubled face. After a moment's hesitation, she reaches out. The chopsticks fall. She quickly grabs them, reaches out for the bowl. <laughs> and I can't keep watching this. Sakura keeps repeating the same action. She reaches out for the food with clumsy hands, but she drops the chopsticks every time and picks them up in a hurry. Hmm. I feel like there's uh, like a disease that seems to match these sorts of symptoms. Hmm. It doesn't seem like her fingers are merely numb. Uh, it looks so clumsy that it seems like she's forgetting how to use the chopsticks every time she picks them up. She doesn't see it. Sakura should know how obvious it is to us, but she doesn't notice. Instead of telling us she's alright, she just keeps going through the same motions. She awkwardly picks up the food, quickly brings it to her mouth, and puts it in with some difficulty, and then tries to remember how to use the chopsticks again. Hmm. She's trying so hard that there's no way I can ask if she's alright. Saka doesn't notice. Or rather, she keeps eating as if she doesn't notice. I do the same. We pretend not to know Sakura's abnormality and finish dinner silently. Hmm. I decide to clean up afterward. Sakura wanted to, but I stopped her. It doesn't seem like she can handle it, and I really don't want her to find out that she can't do something she's so accustomed to. Your fingers will work again. If you sleep and rest, yes, that's why. Not the whole memory loss thing she's been dwelling on. Sakura bites her lip and looks down. Sakura, it's not like I mean, if we honestly believe she was sick, we really should have been. We, 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 we really should not have been, you know, letting her cook. It's that the Sagatirishi. That is an abnormally low bar. Sakura
夕食の準備に2時間もかけた不注意で7回も食器を落としたおまけに味付けだって失敗してた塩加減はまるっきりできてないわ胡椒は効きすぎだわさくらの料理とは思えない張り切るのはいいけど結果が出ないようじゃ逆効果だろう分かったかさくらは元気なつもりでも小さなところで熱が残ってるんだよ言っとくけど俺は怒ってるからな明日から厨房には立たせない完全に治るまでは無理なんてさせないからおとなしく眠ってろ Without waiting for her reply, I pull her to the guest room. Her steps are heavy, but I ignore them and take her to her room.、Uh, Sock is waiting at the door. It's 10 o'clock. I know it's useless, but it's time to go patrol the town. On a slow descent to never being able to come back from this. なんだかんだ言っても疲れてたんだろうなベッドに横になった途端すぐ眠ってくれたそうじゃあ後のことはイリアとライダーに任せましょう姿は見えないけどライダーは屋敷のどこかでさくらを警護してるだろうし Is she? I don't think we've confirmed that I assume she's just saving energy by not making a form but still Riders protecting Sakura just like she says probably maybe I probably I'm sure she's remaining in spirit form to ease the burden of Sakura. I recall the priest's words. The quest from her body will take her magical energy as long as the Holy Grail war continues. It's dangerous to put form to her servant in her condition, and she should save her energy for emergencies. That's why Rider's in spirit form. Something I want to say? How stupid! Of course, I want to say something. Tosaka, Konban no Uchini, Zoken will toss an Ika. We have no time to waste. Sakura is weakening day by day. If I'm to believe the priest's words, she might die tomorrow. Murio, Ima no Watastatija, I teni naranai. A seru no Mohakarukido. Sakura o Tasketai no Nara, Ima a Gaman Nasai. Ima a Mada Tatakawanai. Ah, so I will wakar. けどそれなら巡回の意味がないって言いたいのシロ私たちは造剣さえ倒せればいいの違うでしょ聖杯戦争に巻き込まれて無関係な人間が死ぬことが許せないんじゃなかったの Are we even, even potentially stopping that with our patrols? That's right. I know. I know. The patrol has a meaning. Even if we just run away, if we find them, we can do everything we can so that there won't be victims like yesterday. But. What did I swear to protect more than that oath? Shiro? Choto, daijo, Buemiya kun! Eh, Scotchy memai ga shita dake da. Sore yori, Sman Tosaka. いいわ、別に謝らなくても。さくらも危ないけど、あなただって疲れてるんだもの。本当はね、今日の投影は3日に分けて習得してもらうはずだったのよ。それを今日だけで成功させるぐらい頑張ったんだから、今すぐ戦いたいって気持ちはわかるし。Wait, have I? <笑> I'm able to use projection after just today's training. どうしたの何かおかしなこと言った私いやその今日の鍛錬はきつくて耐えるのに精一杯だったから時間が湧かないみたいだ Idiot, そうね無我夢中って感じだったものけどその甲斐あって最後には一回だけ探検を投影できたじゃないまあ今のところ成功率は1割以下だからこれからよう修行ってことだけど。Well, I guess that's how it was if I got,、uh, if I was that into it. That's probably why it was late afternoon when I noticed. Hmm. Man, 
Man, the days just fly by when you can't remember anything. When we get to town, I realize there's something wrong. Sakamas knows as well because she shuts her mouth and concentrates on the surroundings. Okay, the scene's the same as always. It's past 10 o'clock and the town is dark and quiet. There's no one out in the streets and there's no sound. It's becoming familiar since the Holy Grail War started. A quiet nighttime atmosphere. But... She's a good hit. Saka murmurs beside me. Yeah, it's quiet here. The town has been quiet at night these past few days. It's the deepest silence, the deepest sleep. But still... The silence tonight is quieter even than that. <laughs> Sok is looking down the road that leads to Ryoto Temple. The opposite direction from Chido, right into the suburbs. There's no light there, and it looks like a black wall. Iko. I step into the dark town. Sok is silent. This is something we don't even need to think about. We both know what happened. It's contradictory. Oh no, not Issei. Not my tr one true love, Issei. We know we'll, we'll know we'll have to admit the truth if we go, but we start walking, knowing that we'll be proven wrong. <laughs> what did I feel when I first saw it? A black wall. Completely obscuring the other side. The instant I pass it, I understand what's happened in this area. The town is too quiet. It's not that the town is asleep. This is nothingness, devoid of any human presence. It's total stillness, brought on by the death of everything in this area. I get dizzy. There's no change in the town. The area, about 50 households, are standing in the darkness with no change. There's no sign of broken doors. There's no sign of broken windows. And of course, there are no cranes to remove the roof or, and take everything out of the houses. And at the same time, the presence of the hundreds of people who should live in this area are gone. Why did I just think of? She puts on gloves and goes into a nearby house. She goes by the gate. She opens the front door. She walks through the hallway. She goes up the stairs, looks at the second floor, and confirms that it's empty, and goes back outside. Sadaka says they're gone. The town is like always. The buildings haven't even been scratched, and there are no corpses. It's so clean that nobody would notice the abnormality, even in the morning. But still... This area looks more barren than that time. We look through a few more houses, but it yields the same results. The buildings have no damage, but the people in them are gone. All that's there are traces of magical energy. Every building, road, and ground. The black after image is stuck everywhere. I know that thing caused this disaster. I feel dizzy. I feel like vomiting. Corpse without corpses. Blood without blood. The desolate town engulfed by the shadow. I'm walking in such a place. So why does an unrelated image pop into my head? Very good question. But it's not unrelated. It can't be unrelated if it comes to mind. Stop. Remember, remember. You know this. You know this presence and this smell. It happened back then, too. What did you imagine when you saw it for the first time? Don't realize it. It's the same. No, something heavier engulfed this area. No. That time, too. Why did you... Imagine such a thing. That's. I have no positive proof. I have no reason. I have no motive. I have no evidence. Who is this similar to? That can't be. It's impossible. 
I cannot admit it. But the more I think... I have no proof. So I'm made to believe that my intuition is right. Yes. Because the sensation is... Too similar to the heavy nightmare that comes after making love to... I shake my head to dispel the dizziness. It seems the traces of the shadow are getting to me. Yeah, that, 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 that's in. <laughs><笑>いや、聞き気がするだけだ。俺のことはいいから。話を続けてくれ。と。本当マイタはね、工場した素人の対魔力でもあいつの残滓に当てられちゃうんだ。あれだけの魔力の塊なんだから当然と言えば当然か。あ、あいや。体力がなくなったとかそういうんじゃない。単に気持ちが悪くなっただけで奪われたものはないと思う。サカ町中に残った後からして一軒一軒訪ねていったなんてことじゃなかったはずよ。あれは津波みたいにあの遺体に覆いかぶさって、そのまま地面に溶けていった。よっぽど。けど、無機物は口に合わないみたいね。生きていないもの